guys and today i will be doing a review on the popo saber tooth tiger in the hunting position so if you really want a good saber tooth tiger that is in a good position this one is one of the best ones you can get and also it's made by a good company popo if you really want one that's not just standing there and looks weird this one's a really good it may not be the biggest, or it's not the most realistic one, but it's definitely better than some of the ones I see most of the time, because there's not that much good Smilodons out there. But Popo definitely has a pretty good Smilodon. It's probably not better than some of the other ones I have, but it's definitely not bad. And yes, this one is kind of expensive. Usually on most sites it's $12, but compared to the other ones, it's not as expensive as the other ones because Saratoos are really, really expensive. I like the shade of it and also I like how it doesn't do a little too over those stuff like stripes and dots. Does they have any? I like its tail because some just some saber tooth tails don't even look that good. They're like a little stub and they have like a little black thing on the end. This one actually did something with it. It has a lot of good details like the ribs. You can see the muscle in it. They don't have the biggest teeth and its face kind of looks weird. I like how its ears is perched back. But overall this is a pretty good saber tooth and I also like how it's fur detail and also it looks angry in the muzzle with the detail so overall the Popo saber tooth tiger in the hunting position is a pretty good is a pretty good action figure small on if you need one I say you would probably get this one Here's a horrible view of it. I'll hope you guys enjoyed. And bye.